how to gather it. Today we're going to look at the Alpha Cool heat gun. Heat gun comes in a stable retail package and I'm going to open it now very fast, very quick, just open it. And you can see here the heat gun. It's in a plastic bag. You have a manual inside. And this is what it looks like. What is the technical characteristic of the Alpha Cool heat gun? First, it perfect fits in your hand. It looks good. And second, the diffuser makes a perfect air blow for hard tube banding projects. Third, you have three different setups here. The first goes up to about 100 degrees, the second to about 300 and 350 degrees, which is best temperature for your start with banding projects, and the third goes up to 600 or 650 degrees, which is of course a lot of heat and you may not use it at the beginning, only if you're well experienced. Now I'm going to band the hot tube using the Alpha Cool heat gun and a silicone insert. You need the silicone insert to go into the hot tube because when you band it, the inside diameter will stay at the thickness of the silicone tube. So I'm going to heat it up in the middle here right now just for demonstration. And I'm using the Alpha Cool heat gun on level 2. I've tried to make a 45 degree angel here. Of course the silicone insert is still in there. You have to hold it in this position and wait until it's fully cold again so that you can remove it. And here we go. We have a perfect 45 degree angel now in your Alpha Cool. Tube. The Alpha Cool heat gun runs on 220 volt and is available in two versions with the EU plug and the UK plug. My conclusion of the Alpha Cool heat gun is this. The heat gun is perfect made for banding projects. Because it stands stable on three points here, you can use your fingers, your free hands to rotate the plexi tube above. It has three different heat outputs. And so all in all, it's perfectly made for a banding project.